Nisku neiti. Nisku, nis, nisku. 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 Woman? Yes, it's like the girlfriend of the mommy. Yeah. And it's a famous Finnish... What is it? I would say cartoon series. There are books as well. Tuve Jansson has written those. Tuve Jansson. Uh, no, she she doesn't really, uh, or she didn't really do do cartoons. I I mean, yeah, cartoons, but uh, she did even more. She wrote um, books. books for children and adults. And actually, the Moomin thing was um, from the beginning for adults. But uh, look at that! Is that, you, you wouldn't believe that it's for adults because it looks so childish. Yeah. So um, it's the cartoon character. Yeah. yeah. Yes, but their stories are like uh, for, for adults. For our, not not like porn. Yeah. Not, not sexual. Not, but the meaning is like more uh, for adults people, adult mind. Yeah. yeah. But it's uh, made like very very childish, and that's why Childish. children started to like it, and that's why it became um, a cartoon for children. Mm. And then there is even a. Moomi Lakes in Finland, where you can uh, visit this life-size makeup of the place. Yeah, Moomi like Dalen in Swedish. Yes. It's a, uh, it's like a village, Moomi village. Okay. We we have a one in Finland. It's like a, uh, it's not a Tivoli. It's not a, you know, it doesn't have any attractions or anything. It's just a, uh, a place for children where you can buy a ticket and get in. And then you can like go to the Moomin house yeah. and yeah, like mm -hmm. a, you like know. a not, yes, not park with any Tivoli. I mean, but like like a land, like a village. Yeah, like an amusement park, but not really amusement park because it doesn't have any, okay. you know, things that you can really go and sit down to, like. Um, uh, like a Disneyland, it's not like a Disneyland, like you know. Like no. the, the wheels that, you know, uh, turns, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's so cute. Well, basically, that it's is so a cute. <laughs> place for families. Like my big brother has gone there with his daughter uh, and he spent, spent uh, some family time there. Okay. Yeah. And then, uh, what next? I was going to tell something about the birch. Something else? Mm. Something else maybe. Okay, but um, but if, uh, about this Vita again, I forgot to tell you that we always use these fresh leaves, like we told you, but um, after we've cut them from the tree, we do this, we put it like this, and in the water, like in uh, coal or warm water, I guess yeah. warm water, so it stays fresh. I mean, in the sauna because uh, it dries very fast, oh. so that you can use it like um, the whole evening. You put it in the water and just take it from there. And then, yes. <coughs> if you consider a typical sauna event in Finland, it's like uh, you have a cabin somewhere near the lake. You have this sauna, then you have this uh, lake next to it. You go to the sauna, you have the warmness. Maybe you have those beach teeth. You slash yourself and then you run to the lake and swim a little bit there. Okay. Then you go out and maybe at some point you eat some sausages with mustard. You Makara. Makara, yeah. Yeah. Makara kaya kaya. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I yeah. will never forget your sausage. Yes. Real makara. Mm. Yes. You and sat around the bonfire. Is and that you real grill. makara? Yes. yes. <laughs> you probably shouldn't eat that one because, well, it's probably not so edible so anymore. It has been here for like two days. <laughs> like, no, thank you. Yeah. Okay. And uh, Finnish people also drink very strong alcohol. What's the best alcohol here? Like, you know, the what they have one is Kosken Korva. It's like vodka. Yeah. Like Maybe. vodka. Yeah. So you love hard drinks. Do you know like vodka? Like, yeah. Vodka. Yeah. Uh, so they have their own vod vodka. It's named vodka. Kosken, Kosken Korva. Kosken Korva. And this is the real. Wait, um, do Finnish people have a specification when it comes to alcohol? Like some people, some country mostly drink just wine. wine. Or yep, some people more into hard drinks or beer. 
How about you, Finnish people? You drink beer. A, any kind of alcohol? Yes, any kind, yeah. but like their own is like beer and. Yeah, we Western. have like a. Do we, I guess we have three different uh, different brands of uh, beer here in Finland. We have Karhu, Olvi, Lapinkulta. Ah, and Kof Four. Four different brands. So Finland is also. I mean, I miss the Schwinnerbikov. Mikä vietsi? Missä se on Kof? Jakov. Schwinnerbikov on Kof. Yeah. And uh, and then they have uh, Kosken Korva and Suomi Vina, like like Leijona. Leijona. Different are, names, but they're all strong, strong alcohols, like, just pure alcohol. What's like the highest percentage of alcohol you've got you get here in Finland? In the uh, stores. In the stores. Is like in like Philippines, we only have like uh, But the, seven. They, are not, they are not Finnish ones. Absinthe, Sino uh -huh. You come, well, you like 60. 60 percent but it's not finnish one it's like it came from france i guess how much is uh the highest percent of alcohol in the finnish i don't know Pure. maybe you have to finnish ask the boys 40. okay it's 40 40 45 i, I don't know. yeah and okay. it tastes very very strong have you tasted some no. have you tasted tequila Almost. Yeah, because tequila, tequila has like 40. 40? Yes, tequila has 40, so they have 40, okay. so it's very, very pure. Yeah, but it's, it's it's pure like water, I mean clear like water. But it's very So hard. if you don't really know what you have in your glass, you can think it's water, and when you drink it, you're like, okay, it wasn't water. <laughs> it um, happens very often in Finland that at parties really? you think it's water and you start drinking it. And, then oh. and sometimes they drink... Uh, without anything, and um, sometimes they blend it with juice, juice or okay. sodas. Yes, whatever. Yeah. In so you make drinks shishu? of it. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Uh, and then, yes. are the well, 